Commander Vitalia! The South Gate has fallen! The city will be overwhelmed! Get these people to the boats! Yes, sir. I need to get to the docks. Is there another way? Yes, sir. You can cut through the slums there. The Britons are coming! The Britons are coming! Give me a sword, someone, and I'll fight these bastards off myself! Get to the boat! Get to the boat! Help! Archers! Keep down!
Roman! Get it! Italian is serving the retreat. We must fall back to the courthouse. Sir, ground to a halt. Been here for the hour. They have embedded archers. Those barbarians just won't fall. Come on, then! Let's show them the strength of our shields! And the edge of our blades! Shields, men! Open for the retreat. I'll meet with Vitalian at the courthouse. Yes, sir.
Barricade this entrance there. We must ready ourselves for the next assault. Marius, come. Follow me. Thank the gods we might get some respite. York is lost. We must get as many of our men out as we can. The river. That's the only way out now. We'll get them on the ship from Rome. It's armored and will withstand anything the barbarians can throw at it. No. They will have to go on the other boats. Commodus and his guard escaped on the warship. They were the first to run. The first out of the harbor. Kicking aside women and children as they fled. Status of our defenses, soldier. We're cut off from all districts and trying to hold the bridges, but most of our men have been evacuated. Good. When all our men are safe, we will evacuate on the last boat out. Are you clear? Yes, sir. Marius, this way. We must get word out. Tell the Senate. What Commodus has done will have to be paid for. Agreed. Take command, Marius. Reach our men on the bridge and bring them back. You I'll then. oversee the evacuation. Pull back! We're getting you out of here. I'll take the Scorpio and provide you cover. You men, pull me back to the back. Get oh, man. Move! Watch your volley! Ready! Fire volley! Fire volley! Fire volley! Until the ship is clear. No! You have to go. You must live. The Senate will listen to you. You're a commander. They have to. Now go!
Damocles was a great warrior. A revered leader in a vast army. His cowardly commanders abandoned him. Nemesis, the goddess of revenge, allowed Damocles to return to the world as a vengeful spirit. A ghostly, black-armored centurion who would hunt down and kill each of the generals who had wronged him. You are a general of Rome. I brought you here to protect me from Damocles. <laughs> but you are Damocles! <laughs> Gods protect me. You are Damocles! Indeed I am. And my story is almost at an end. I became driven by one thought, one solitary desire, the desire for vengeance. Vengeance against the Emperor Nero, who had my family butchered. Vengeance against his despicable sons, who betrayed my legion! In order to exact my vengeance, I'd have to return to where my journey began. Return to my home. Danger surrounded me on my journey back to Rome. The evil which had plagued Britain had now infected this city. Starving refugees from our once free Rome lined the roads, telling tales of deprivation and torture. The rule of law lay shattered. My life's solitary purpose was to return to Rome and end the evil that you created, Nero. To prevent you from destroying the Rome that I love and to return it to its people. Why? Why, oh God, why? <laughs> What's this then? Valiant hero? Battle-scarred veteran of the campaigns? Drop your swords, or I will kill you where you stand. Get him! Don't let him talk to you like that! Have him! <laughs> Oh, <laughs> 
Sir! The legionary murdered Atticus and Janus! Someone's in there. You two, take a look. Nothing. Get back to your post. Yes, sir. I'm gonna have to stay off the streets if I want to avoid trouble. Soldier on the kill, and we're going to find him. You murdering scum! Come on, lad! <laughs> Drop your weapons!
59! How many more? About a hundred or so. Up on Veer or Gusty. Someone drew Nero's face on the horse's ass. Not a good idea. Talk about collective punishment. We're burying the whole street. There's no clean water, no sanitation, no bedding, and food. What food? I have to beg for it. Are you lost? You see, Marius, it's not always in distant lands that our greatest enemies lurk. Who are you? Why did this happen? My father was a hero of Rome. Your father was a great general and a popular senator. Too popular, perhaps. The Emperor is a jealous man. A petty man. Your father lived to serve Rome. Emperor Nero serves only himself. He seeks power for the sake of power. He believes himself a god. A cold wind from the north whispered poisonous words in the emperor's ear. Your father and other like-minded men wanted to return Rome to its people. So the emperor had them murdered. After all, that is what emperors do. The spoils of his greed were divided between his sons, Basilius and Commodus. He lavished upon them great powers and responsibilities for which they were unworthy. Rome is failing its children, Marius. You are a vital piece in the game of man. And you, like all of us, have a role to play. Damocles, spirit of vengeance. The fate of the Empire is in your hands. Save Rome. Save Rome from them. I needed entry to the Emperor's tournament. This could be granted by just one man, 
so I paid him a visit. Damocles? I come for the tournament. Ah! <laughs> You're a gladiator. <laughs> oh. mm, the, uh, the mythical armor is it's a fine touch indeed. You gave me quite the shape. Only the most skilled fighters can enter the tournament. Let me see if you fight as well as you dress. 